Rafael Colon has been in the woodworking business for 20 years. For the past 16 years, he has owned and operated Woodrich in Lycoming County. His business gives trees located in urban areas of central Pennsylvania a second chance. The trees, what we do is they're disease dead, blow down, emerald ash borer, all kinds of uh, variables of the tree coming down and then we give them new life. Cologne and his crew of just three other employees take these dying or down trees and repurpose them into classic or custom furniture items. It's furniture, countertops, mantles, floating shelves, dining tables, end tables, beds, credenzas, end stands. That's, we utilize the wood in every way. Cologne's passion and name of his business is spirited by the history of Williamsport once being known as the lumber capital of the world. I went to school for forestry here at Penn College and also I was following the historic lumber capital 1879 the history of it and um, it's just a cool it pulls it all together and the name wood rich I got because we are rich in wood. Newswatch 16 traveled to the business's showroom located in the old Coca-Cola bottling plant on Church Street in Williamsport but all of the products are made out of a sawmill located in Kogan Station. We're a wood butcher. We start from the log and from the very end, mill it, dry it, and then build and craft. Many of the downtown Williamsport businesses are furnished by Woodrich. The company even sells around the world, meaning trees from our area are global. Uh, from Qatar to New York City, uh, Netherlands, we just shipped 10 tables to the Netherlands. We, we ship all over. The business even offers tree slabs for anyone looking for some DIY fun. Chris Keating, Newswatch 16, Lycoming County.